Yep. Hi there, my name's James Clark and I work at Hook Norton Brewery and I'm sat outside the brewery right now and uh, here to talk briefly about a new beer that we've brewed, a beer called Resist. And this is a recipe that was circulated around the globe by the Drinkers for Ukraine, asking brewers to make this beer uh, to show solidarity, to raise awareness of their plight and also hopefully to raise some money for charity. So this is a departure for us. We have brewed a few stout style beers in the past, um, but this is a stout at 6% and it also contains some beetroot, so Borscht style there. Um, it's something we've not tried before and uh, to get the beetroot, we put out a message locally on social media and two ladies very kindly cooked, peeled and brought the beetroot here. And that was added to the beer a week ago. Uh, it has some Marisota pale malt in it, obviously some dark malt, some chocolate malt, and also some huskless black malt, some carafa malt, and uh, it has some oats in it as well. And um, then it had some beetroot added at the end of fermentation. So lovely beer, lovely, quite a tight head on there. I think there's probably been some um, priming, some extra fermentation from the sugars and the beetroot. Lovely dark, rich color there. Get that roasty notes coming through, a bit of caramel vanilla coming through. Touch of coffee, not too much. And as you sip the beer, all of those flavours you've initially got on the nose are sort of taken away by that earthiness of the beetroot, which runs up the middle of the tongue. But it doesn't linger two or three seconds later and you get that black malt coming around the edge of the tongue again. Uh, there's some bitterness in there from the um, hop content, but not a lot of hop aroma there. Most of the characters from the, uh, the dark malts in the beer. So it's a 6% beer. Um, we're, it's the least we could do to be involved and, uh, and help raise awareness. We have been using one of our vans locally to collect donated items from various hubs and take them to the central hub in, in Banbury. Um, and as a slight aside, I also spent 14 years in, in the fire service locally, so sort of a real affinity, not just with everything that's happening in the Ukraine, but particularly with the emergency services over there having to deal with um, fires and, and building collapses and so on, of that sort of unprecedented, um, unprecedented challenge. So, we are showing solidarity with everybody in the Ukraine. It's great to see the effort across the world in, in supporting the Ukrainians. Um, I'm wearing a t-shirt from the International Brewing Awards that I judged out a few years ago, back in 2005 when we judged these awards that were actually held in Munich in conjunction with one of the brewing exhibitions. Uh, I was on a judging team there with a brewer um, from Kiev. So it's quite close to home. It's great to see the efforts that being done to support the Ukrainian people and this is just a very small token but this is from Hook Norton and um, we raise to your health.